Hello, everyone. The Duke of Kent's astonishing declaration to imprison Meghan Markle has sent shockwaves through the royal landscape, igniting a firestorm of intrigue among royal watchers and critics alike. The dramatic backdrop? A long-lost jewel once belonging to the late Queen Elizabeth Sue, a piece that has remained elusive for centuries, is thought to be part of a historically significant collection steeped in royal lore. It wasn't just any old trinket. This jewel, whispered to be priceless, has suddenly re-emerged, glimmering on the Duchess of Sussex person at a recent high-profile event. And if that wasn't scandalous enough, the plot thickens. Forensic analysis has revealed that the fingerprints on the jewel belong to none other than Meghan herself. Cue the gasps. The ramifications of this revelation could be monumental, shaking the very foundations of Meghan's already shaky standing with the royal family. In a world where every misstep is magnified through the lens of public scrutiny, Meghan's penchant for drama has taken yet another twist, making her recent escapade resemble an episode of a poorly scripted reality show. Is this the ultimate bid for relevance? Or has Meghan genuinely lost the plot in her attempts to reconnect with her royal roots? Those familiar with her history might not be surprised to find the Duchess embroiled in yet another scandal, her aspirations of modernizing the monarchy crumbling faster than a poorly built sandcastle. Insiders have hinted at a palpable rage within royal circles, particularly among those who have long been protective of the monarchy's storied legacy. We cannot allow this kind of behavior to tarnish the legacy of the monarchy, the Duke of Kent reportedly stated his words dripping with indignation. After all, what good is a monarchy if it's reduced to a spectacle of misappropriation and misplaced aspirations? Royal purists, clutching their pearls in outrage, are likely sharpening their quills to pen scathing missives on the latest debacle. The implications for Meghan could be dire. Already a pariah in certain royal circles, she now faces the potential of legal repercussions that could unravel any semblance of a new life she and Harry have attempted to build in the United States. The drama of her life, which has become a relentless saga of misfortune and scandal, now features a storyline reminiscent of a heist film gone awry. Perhaps Meghan thought the jewel would serve as a talisman of sorts, a piece of royal heritage to solidify her ties to a family she seems desperate to redefine. If that was her goal, it spectacularly backfired, revealing her as not just a former royal, but a woman caught in a web of poor judgment and increasingly questionable choices. The jewel's origins are as murky as Meghan's motivations. For decades, it lay hidden, part of a royal collection thought to be too sacred to touch. And yet, here it is, allegedly draped around the neck of a woman with an uncanny ability to turn every occasion into a tabloid frenzy. How could a piece so historically significant find itself in the hands of someone whose own royal narrative has become an ongoing series of blunders? It raises questions that even the most skilled royal watchers can't easily answer. Was it hubris, a grave miscalculation, or simply the desperation of a woman attempting to reclaim her lost identity. What makes this incident even more captivating is the revelation that the jewel, once the pride of the monarchy, now carries the unmistakable fingerprints of Meghan Markle herself. The forensic experts have spoken, and their findings are as damning as they are compelling. This shocking twist only adds fuel to the fire, painting Meghan as a figure who, rather than honoring her royal past, has chosen to brazenly flaunt it as if it were a costume from her days in Hollywood. As the saga unfolds, one can only wonder how Meghan will respond. Will she come forward, perhaps with another tearful confession or a melodramatic social media post to reshape the narrative? Or will she opt for radio silence, hoping the dust will settle like it has after previous scandals? Whatever her choice, the world will undoubtedly be watching popcorn in hand as the latest episode in the life of Meghan Markle unfolds. Meanwhile, the Duke of Kent, 
stands firm, a bastion of royal tradition in an era fraught with chaos. His commitment to upholding the dignity of the royal family in the face of Meghan's antics is commendable, if not entirely expected. After all, maintaining the monarchy's integrity has never been a simple task, and Meghan's latest escapade only complicates matters further. The air is thick with anticipation and speculation, and every royal aficionado is left wondering if this is the beginning of the end for Meghan's already tenuous connection to the crown. In a world where public perception can shift as rapidly as the weather, it remains to be seen how Meghan will navigate this treacherous terrain. The jewel may glimmer and shine, but the shadows it casts are equally compelling. As the royal drama plays out like a gripping novel, one thing is clear. The repercussions of this latest escapade will echo through the annals of royal history, a testament to the turbulent relationship between Meghan Markle and the institution she once sought to be part of. The line between royalty and celebrity has never seemed more blurred, and as Meghan grapples with her identity, the royal family marches on, steadfast in tradition, leaving her to ponder where she fits in a world that has already moved on without her. What we witness is not just the downfall of a former royal, but the perpetuation of a narrative that serves as a cautionary tale for those who think they can bend the monarchy to their will. The echoes of Meghan's missteps resonate loudly, reminding us all that in the realm of royalty, the stakes are as high as the jewels they seek to claim. Will this incident propel her into a legal quagmire, or will it merely serve as another chapter in her complex, tumultuous journey? As the drama surrounding Meghan Markle deepens, one can't help but roll their eyes at her seeming inability to remain out of trouble, no matter how many life coaches or PR advisors she employs. The revelation that her fingerprints were found on Queen Elizabeth II missing jewel has thrown her into a scandalous spotlight, one that seems tailor-made for a reality TV series titled Keeping Up With The Royals, the audacity of Meghan to adorn herself with such a historically significant piece is like showing up to a black tie event in a sequined tracksuit, loud, inappropriate, and oh so obvious. Perhaps Meghan thought she could simply borrow a touch of royal allure, as if donning a crown jewel would elevate her public persona from Duchess of Confusion to Queen of the Red Carpet. Newsflash, Meghan wearing the crown jewels does not a royal make. Her attempts at royalty come across as a cheap imitation like trying to serve caviar on a plastic plate. The jewelry may be exquisite, but it certainly doesn't hide the fact that she's still just Meghan from Los Angeles, not a bona fide member of the British royal family. Royal experts have been quick to weigh in on her motives. Was it a brazen attempt to reclaim some semblance of royal heritage, or merely a misguided effort to garner sympathy from an audience that has grown weary of her antics. It's as if she's playing dress-up in her grandmother's attic, remarked one commentator, underscoring the absurdity of Meghan's position. How deliciously ironic that she, who once sought to break free from the monarchy's constraints, has instead entangled herself in a scandal that could land her in hot water with the very institution she attempted to escape. It's almost poetic to witness Meghan's current predicament, a classic case of, be careful what you wish for. Her desire to carve a niche in royal history has backfired spectacularly, with the missing jewel now serving as a metaphor for her entire royal experience, beautiful on the outside, but riddled with cracks and questionable origins beneath the surface. The jewel was rumored to have been lost for centuries, much like Meghan's sense of decorum and respect for royal tradition. Is she trying to claim her place in history, or just trying to stage a comeback in the latest royal soap opera? Mused one royal historian, reflecting the broader skepticism about her intentions. With the Duke of Kent vowing to uphold the integrity of the monarchy, the stakes have never been higher for Meghan. His fierce proclamation that he would not tolerate any form of misconduct is the royal equivalent of a warning shot 
fired across the bow. If Megan thought she could waltz into the royal narrative with her head held high and a stolen jewel gleaming at her throat, she clearly underestimated the royal family's ability to defend its legacy. Good luck explaining that to the Queen's ghost, darling. And one Twitter user snarkily commented, highlighting the precarious position Meghan has found herself in. The media frenzy surrounding this scandal has been nothing short of spectacular, with outlets scrambling to cover every angle. The hashtag, JewelGate, has become a rallying cry for both Meghan's supporters and detractors, proving that in the age of social media, the royal family is no longer immune to public opinion. She's always been a fan of drama, quipped one royal correspondent. Now, she's just auditioning for the role of royal rogue, a part she might just win with all this chaos. As the whispers of her alleged misdeeds echo through the halls of Buckingham Palace, the question arises, how will Meghan navigate this latest public relations nightmare? Will she channel her inner diva and stage yet another over-the-top media blitz? Or will she attempt to play the victim card, casting herself as a misunderstood woman caught in a web of royal intrigue? The irony is almost unbearable. This is a woman who once claimed to be tired of playing a part, now seemingly diving headfirst into the role of a lifetime, complete with scandal and intrigue. One must wonder if Meghan's PR team is pulling their hair out at the prospect of handling yet another crisis. Just when you think it can't get worse, it gets worse, remarked a source close to the situation, perfectly encapsulating the ongoing saga of Meghan's royal adventure. If she's trying to rewrite her narrative as the underdog in this scenario, she may be in for a rude awakening. Her latest escapade has all the charm of a poorly scripted telenovela replete with plot twists that leave viewers shaking their heads in disbelief. While the world watches this unfolding drama with popcorn in hand, it's clear that Meghan's attempts to navigate the royal landscape have been anything but graceful. Instead, she resembles a bull in a china shop, careening from one disaster to another, leaving broken pieces in her wake. The public's appetite for royal drama shows no signs of waning. And if anything, this jewel incident has only fanned the flames of intrigue. The royal family is left to pick up the pieces, all while Meghan clings to her image, desperately hoping that somehow she can emerge unscathed from the wreckage of her own making. As the fallout from this incident continues, the juxtaposition of Meghan's aspirations and the reality of her situation has never been more stark. She once envisioned herself as a beacon of modernity and progress within the royal family, but her penchant for missteps has turned her into a cautionary tale, one that serves as a reminder of the delicate balance between ambition and respect for tradition. If she wanted to make a statement, she certainly did, noted a royal commentator. It just wasn't the one she intended. The jewel itself has now become emblematic of the ongoing saga a tangible representation of Meghan's struggles to fit into a world that she has repeatedly shown a disregard for. The notion that she could simply claim a piece of royal history as her own is both laughable and tragic, underscoring a fundamental misunderstanding of what it means to be part of the royal family. It's almost as if she thinks she can rewrite history with a little bling, one royal historian pointed out, shaking their head in disbelief. As this scandal unfolds, one can only anticipate how Meghan will respond. Will she maintain her characteristic defiance, or will she attempt to address the situation with a carefully curated statement designed to placate her critics? History suggests she may do both, making grand proclamations while simultaneously playing the victim, a duality that has become her trademark. If only she put as much effort into understanding the monarchy as she does into crafting her narratives, quipped one royal expert, perfectly summarizing the irony of Meghan's plight. The consequences of this incident may extend beyond Meghan's immediate reputation. They could also impact her family dynamics.
As the world scrutinizes every detail of her life with a fine-tooth comb, the strain on her marriage to Prince Harry becomes increasingly apparent. Are they united in this chaos, or is it only a matter of time before the cracks begin to show? Speculation swirls regarding whether Meghan's latest blunder will be the tipping point for the couple, with some insiders suggesting that Harry may begin to question whether the cost of their lifestyle is worth the price of public scorn. One can almost hear the collective gasp from royal observers as they watch Meghan navigate these treacherous waters. Will she learn from her mistakes and take a step back to reassess her position? Or will she barrel forward, fueled by the very hubris that has led her to this moment? Whatever the outcome, it's clear that Meghan's journey is far from over and the world will continue to watch with bated breath. Popcorn in hand, as she spins her tail, a saga filled with the jewels, drama, and a level of sarcasm that only the British royal family can truly appreciate. As the drama unfolds, it's impossible not to indulge in a bit of dark humor at Meghan's expense. With her penchant for theatricality and her uncanny ability to find herself at the center of controversy, she's become a modern-day Shakespearean character, tragic, comical, and endlessly captivating. One can only hope that her next chapter will feature fewer missteps and more self-awareness, allowing her to step back from the precipice of public opinion and reframe her narrative before it spirals further out of control. Until then, the saga of Meghan Markle continues. A reminder that in the world of royalty, the jewels may shine, but the truth will always glitter just a bit brighter. The saga surrounding Meghan Markle and the missing jewel of Queen Elizabeth II transcends a mere incident within the royal family. It delves into profound issues regarding reputation, responsibility, and tradition. When news broke that Meghan, a figure many believe abandoned royal life in pursuit of Freedom and independence was found adorned with one of the Queen's invaluable treasures. It was hard not to feel a hint of irony. One cannot deny that Meghan is a polarizing figure, someone adept at capturing attention. From her public complaints about royal life to shocking interviews, she has constructed a brand that is simultaneously bold and riddled with contradictions. This latest episode further highlights her somewhat comical persona. Like a character in a farcical play, Meghan seems oblivious to the fact that every action she takes is meticulously scrutinized by the public. With this jewel, it appears she forgot that there are values and legacies that cannot be compromised. The revelation of her fingerprints on the piece not only sparked speculation about her motivations, but also underscored a stark reality. One cannot simply borrow the grandeur of royal heritage without facing the consequences. It raises the question of whether Meghan was attempting to reconnect with her royal roots, or if this was merely a misguided decision that could result in severe legal repercussions. As royal experts dissect the implications of this scandal, one can't help but reflect on the gravity of what Queen Elizabeth II represented. Her reign was characterized by dignity, resilience, and an unwavering commitment to duty. In stark contrast, Meghan's actions seem almost frivolous. The juxtaposition is jarring. While the Queen meticulously maintained the monarchy's integrity, Meghan appears to treat royal heritage as a costume, something to be donned when convenient. Moreover, the Duke of Kent's vow to pursue legal action against Meghan is not just a reaction to the incident itself. It's a broader statement on the preservation of royal values. His emphasis on protecting the monarchy's legacy echoes a sentiment that resonates deeply with royal fans and critics alike. How can the monarchy thrive when its members engage in such capricious behavior? This question looms larger than life as the drama unfolds. The underlying currents of this situation reflect Meghan's ongoing struggle to carve out an identity that exists independently of her royal ties. Her previous attempts to distance herself from royal expectations often come across as misguided, and this incident amplifies 
that perception. Is this a desperate grasp for relevance or an indication of deeper insecurities regarding her place in the world? The allure of royal jewels, after all, symbolizes not just wealth, but an enduring legacy, a stark reminder of what she ostensibly left behind. In the wake of this scandal, the public is left to ponder. Will Meghan address these allegations with the same fervor she's applied to her previous grievances against the royal family? Or will she remain silent as the storm brews around her? The stakes have never been higher, and the world watches with bated breath, waiting for her next move. After all, when it comes to royal drama, the plot thickens and the intrigue only deepens. As Meghan navigates this complex web of scrutiny and speculation, one thing is clear. Her relationship with the monarchy has reached a critical juncture. The juxtaposition of her current predicament against the backdrop of Queen, Elizabeth's dignified reign invites a deeper analysis of the values at play. While the Queen symbolized continuity and stability, Meghan's journey seems fraught with chaos and contradiction. This ongoing saga is also a reflection of the broader cultural landscape, where the lines between celebrity and royalty blur. Meghan's attempts to embrace her individuality within the constraints of royal life often appear more like a marketing strategy than a genuine quest for authenticity. This misalignment raises the question, in a world captivated by celebrity culture, can one truly honor royal legacy while simultaneously seeking to reinvent oneself? The scrutiny Meghan faces is a testament to the enduring legacy of Queen Elizabeth II. The Queen's commitment to her role and the responsibilities that come with it stand in stark contrast to Meghan's perceived antics. As royal fans and critics alike dissect these events, it becomes increasingly evident that the monarchy's values are more than just tradition. They represent an expectation of decorum and integrity that Meghan seems to dismiss. In conclusion, this unfolding drama serves as a potent reminder of the complexities inherent in the intersection of celebrity and royalty. As Meghan grapples with the consequences of her actions, the world waits to see if she will choose to honor the legacy of Queen Elizabeth II or continue down a path of sensationalism. Ultimately, the question remains, can the allure of a missing jewel overshadow the weight of a royal legacy? Only time will tell. With the Duke of Kent's vow to uphold royal integrity and potential legal repercussions looming, this saga highlights the stark contrast between the enduring legacy of the monarchy and Meghan's tumultuous journey. Will she confront the allegations or remain silent in the face of scrutiny? One thing is clear, the world is watching, and the implications of this scandal could forever alter her relationship with the royal family. If you found this breakdown intriguing, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more updates on this captivating royal saga. Share your thoughts in the comments below. What do you think Meghan's next move will be?